going to a vegan bakery and a bookstore, which is also eco-friendly. So that is super, super awesome, and I'm really, really excited to share it with you guys. So, come along, let's go! Here we are! This place is called Korsirani and is located near Daegu downtown. It's 100% vegan, with all its ingredients being plant-based. It's open every day from 12 to 6 p.m., except for Sundays and Mondays. Let's look around, shall we? The atmosphere is super cozy, the playlist is amazing, and it has loads of books to choose from. But let's order first, okay? The prices are very reasonable, with coffee for about 4,000 won, different kind of soy milk based drinks for 6, and other food drinks as well. The bread and cakes go from 2 to 6,000 won. This place is super eco-friendly too, so you get a 5% off if you bring your own tumbler or a lunchbox. So, so many delicious things to choose from. I heard they sell out pretty early, so you might want to get here quick to be able to choose the most delicious of them all. Okay, let's find a place to sit and choose a book, shall we? There are loads of books to choose from, covering a diversity of topics. Of course, you can find all possible books on vegan lifestyle, environmental issues and more. I absolutely loved all the posters and drawings on the walls. I think they would speak to a younger customer, as well as people who randomly stumble upon this place. And hey, it might just change their life, you know? And they have lots of kids books too, which was awesome. Okay, here's our food. <sighs> so excited! Of course I had to choose this chocolate cake, are you serious? Isn't it just a piece of art? And it looks so Christmassy too, if you ask me. So I picked my book and I'm ready to taste this deliciousness. I brought my own tumbler as you can see, so I got 5% off. It was such a nice weather that day. Honestly, the coffee was not the absolute best, but then again, I've always been a tea kind of a person, so maybe that's why. Still, on this autumn day, it was really lovely. The cake, on the other hand, was so freaking delicious. Even more so because on a daily basis I don't really snack around and I eat super clean, so this was a positive sweet change. Just look at how good it looks. It had chocolate filling and chocolate crunches on top, and I think apart from those two, there was no added sugar because the base was not sweet at all. And this is my book! Yum, yum, yum. What cake time! <laughs> And yes, I dance when I eat delicious food. <laughs> okay, time to enjoy my book, this yummy cake, and this amazing afternoon. I chose an LGBTQ topic book, and honestly my heart went, oh, when I saw that I have LGBTQ books in the shop. Minorities stand with minorities, right? It's like the ones who are hurting the most stand with other people who are hurting. So at that moment, I was just like so, so, so happy to be a part of both the vegan community and the LGBTQ community. It just won my heart. And here I will show you some more of the breads and cakes that I have because honestly, the shot at the beginning behind the glass door doesn't really give them justice. So you can see different kind of cakes and bread here. And you can see that this place advises you to bring your own lunch boxes and paper bags that you don't use instead of throwing them out so if you bring your box you can take uh, take out in it or you can leave it at a shop and then the next person who doesn't have a bag or a takeout can use yours oh and I really like this quote just go no matter how shitty the day is just go so yeah here you can see some of the bags that other customers have left so if you bring your own you can just leave them here or use it with your takeout. It was the perfect, perfect day for the perfect cafe experience, if you will. 
see you guys next time and please follow me on my other social media maria dreams bye